African Footballer of the Year Yaya Toure was in Nairobi, Kenya on Tuesday as he lent his support to a United Nations environment program against ivory poaching. And during his visit, he spoke out about the alleged racist abuse he endured during City's 2-1 win against CSK Moscow in the Russian capital last week. After the match, Troy met head of FIFA's anti-racism task force Jeffrey Webb to discuss the matter, and UEFA's disciplinary board are due to meet on Wednesday to decide whether the Manchester City midfielder was racially abused and to discuss possible sanctions against CSK Moscow. The hearing will be held in private, and neither Torre nor any representatives from the two clubs involved will be present. But Torre, who has threatened to play a boycott of the 2018 World Cup if incidents of racism persist within the country, is pleased that action is being taken. The meeting was very constructive. We talked a lot and we agreed on many aspects. He is someone very clear about the future. And I think today he realizes that the institutions know what they need to do. What is important today is to send a clear message and to educate people because we should not see rowdy fans or fans behaving worse than they did.